What's up guys, it's Ross Solo, back again with another video. So give me well as you can tell, some time has obviously passed on since I started recording this video. It is now 7.30, probably started uh, probably at like 4.40 or something like that, I don't even know. Basically this video is going to be like things that just bother me or you know make me just Urgh. So it's like it's like a pet peeves video or just things that bother me. First thing, math. Math is math just no no explanation for math. Just math is math and uh, don't like that at all. So let's just get that out of the way. It's caramel. Caramel, not caramel. It's caramel. All right? End of conversation. I absolutely hate when balloons are like rubbed or like where you like touch the balloons and they make that really like squeaky sound. It's like, ugh, and it just makes me like gag and just, oh, it hurts. It's, it's not pleasant. I hate it so much. Listen, people, there's this new dance craze. I don't know if you've heard of it. It's called the dab. Look at my dab. All right, so, uh, Basically where I'm going at with this is that when people cough or sneeze, just not even covering up, they're like, <coughs> just like out into the air. Like, I don't need your germ infested breath in my face, all right? You could cover that up. Not, not with your hands. When you start using your hands, you touch things and spread the germs. Just hit your elbow and this is where the dab comes in, you know? It's a thing now, so you could just, Choo! or, <coughs> <laughs> you know, just, just like. Look at my down. Look at my down. Look at my down. You know, just cover it up. All right, wobbly desks and like tables. Like if you're sitting on them, like at the desks in school. If you're sitting down at a desk and you're like you're writing, but like the desk is like, you know, like you're not gonna be able to sit still. It's like wobbling all over the place. That. Oh. Those aggravate me so much. And then when they squeak too, it's like ee, ee. And I always get those types of desks when I'm taking a test. Like, really? Yesterday I didn't have that desk, but on the test day, I gotta have the desk. It's like ee, re, re, re. As I'm like changing positions, because I don't want to sit in one position for the whole class. As I do that, the whole desk, like, you know, it's just making so much noise. It needs to be quiet, you know, people concentrating and stuff. A along the topic of like wobbly wheels and stuff, just in general, just shopping carts, but like with the one bad wheel that like spins around and like flops all over the place. So like you have your shopping cart and you just push it along, but there's that one wheel that just gets caught and you're like, start pushing this cart and it won't move or like makes a lot of rackety noises and stuff. Those also are very aggravating. Kids bop. No explanation necessary. Just kids bop. But seriously, why does kids bop even exist? If I like a song, I don't want to hear like little children singing a song I like because then I don't like it anymore because they just ruined it. They ruined my song experience. I'm listening to my nice music and then I got to hear kids singing it in their own way. Like, not necessary. Whenever someone just starts a sentence with no offense, but why are you telling me this if it's obviously gonna be offensive in some sort of way? The, uh, if you're saying no offense, it's gonna be an offensive statement. You're just trying to cover it up with, oh, no offense, but uh, you know, your hair looks terrible. But no offense, you know, I didn't didn't mean that to be offensive. I was just letting you know. <laughs> Stop, you just, if it's offensive, just keep it to yourself. Or don't even say no offense, just go ahead and say. You know, you ever have that time when you're eating food and someone just reaches over and takes some of your food and then after they take the food they ask you if they can have it why do you need to ask me if it's already in your hand what am i going to say no put it back i mean you already took it why do it doesn't make sense why why would i say no all right guys, well thanks for watching my video of things that bother me, anger me, pet peeves, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. So thanks for watching, if you like it, hit the like button, subscribe for stuff like this, vlogs, I don't know, cinematography type stuff, I'm just challenges this, that, and I'm all over the place. See you in the next video. Peace.